fly on my flat so severe it's actually made me homeless I mean luckily uh, all my sort of materials to do with the film my music are, are okay um, but uh, it's, it's a bit of a nightmare it's a bit of a setback but uh, last night um, my heater caught fire my clothesline caught fire and uh, obviously I, I could have nearly died if it wasn't for Kirsty phoning in the fire engine. And we both had to go to hospital to make sure our lungs and everything all right. It feels like I smoked about 50 cigarettes. Coughing a bit, but it's, it's, it's shock, but to be honest, nothing shocks me anymore. But I decided to, to make a joke out of the situation. Because you can be sad, you can be depressed, you can be really like tearful and stuff. I mean, what's the point? It's just a shit of a building. The main thing is um, myself and Kirsty are okay and we're alive. But the fire started, um, me and Kirsty were right at night at a club and um, came back. Um, then so Kirsty was woken, but there was a fire, a fire in my bathroom because I got one of these like, old fashioned heat heaters. Uh, basically, she saved my life because she phoned the, the, the fire services uh, which came and luckily they put out the flames in the bathroom. Uh, so here we are next day in my flat. Um, I was sort of laughing and joking about it earlier but it's quite serious. Um, this is my home uh, which I really miss because it's not a creative place and where lots of creative stuff happens but it, it, will, it will be back. Back and better. <laughs> As you can see we've got a cage wrap poster here. It's completely um, destroyed, but then that's only a poster, it's not a person. <laughs> so you can't read a build, build a person when they're gone. So, it's glad to be alive. <laughs> Luckily the script is hopefully intact because it's on my PC and none of the sort of tapes and stuff that I've, well, for my videos filmed, they're all, all intact. The show will go on, the film will go on. And um, if it's a bit right, I mean, it's only to, to be honest, it's, it's, it's my creative space, but it can be re rebuilt, redone. Uh, a lot of my CD collection was damaged in the fire, um, which, is a, which is a shame. Some of it's a shame, some of it's not a shame. Um, it's the packaging. Here we have um, the embers of a CD, a Duran Duran, and some of my CDs have been just destroyed in the fire. Daniel Benefield has been damaged. Anything is possible. That's all. Like print is intact. While I'm a hotel room, while I'm homeless, I can spend my time on the script. Sorry for me. I don't, I'm not going to feel sorry for myself because what's, what's the point? I mean, there's people in, in need. I've got friends around me, some people have. So I'm not going to feel sorry for myself. Mm -hmm. 